everyone and welcome back. In 1990, John Romke created a toaster that could be turned on and off over the internet. There are today many devices that are connected, they collect and share data over the internet. Now you can check your fridge and add items to your shopping list, heat water and get to watch a delivery man into your house and place a package then leaves. All that and you're not at your house. What merged the physical and digital worlds is the technology of Internet of Things. If you want to learn more about IoT, then watch this video till the end. The Internet of Things is a network of interconnected embedded devices that can capture and transmit data without the need for human interaction over a wireless network. Examples of IoT, smart wearables, smart health monitoring, traffic monitoring, IoT in agriculture with many sensors, smart devices, robots, smart grids, water supply, and so on. What technologies have made IoT possible? While the idea of IoT has been in existence for a long time, a collection of recent advances in several different technologies has made it practical. Affordable and reliable sensors are making IoT technology possible for more manufacturers. Connectivity A host of network protocols for the internet has made it easy to connect sensors to the cloud and other things for efficient data transfer. Cloud computing platforms The increase in the availability of cloud platforms enables both businesses and consumers to access the infrastructure they need to scale up without actually having to manage it all. Machine learning and analytics With advances in machine learning and analytics, along with access to varied and vast amounts of data stored in the cloud, businesses can gather insights faster and more easily. The emergence of these allied technologies continues to push the boundaries of IoT and the data produced by IoT also feeds these technologies. Conversational artificial intelligence, advances in neural networks have brought natural language processing to IoT devices such as digital personal assistants Alexa, Cortana, and Siri and made them appealing, affordable, and viable for home use. The idea of adding sensors and intelligence to basic objects was discussed through the 1980s and the 90s, but apart from some early projects, including an internet-connected vending machine, progress was slow simply because the technology wasn't ready. Chips were too big and bulky and there was no way for objects to communicate effectively. Processors that were cheap and powerful enough to be all but disposable were needed before it finally became cost-effective to connect billions of devices. The adoption of radio frequency identification tags, RFID, low-power chips that can communicate wirelessly solved some of these issues along with the increasing availability of broadband internet and cellular and wireless networking. The adoption of IP version 6, which among other things, should provide enough IP addresses for every device the world or indeed the galaxy is ever likely to need, was also a necessary step for the IoT to scale. Kevin Ashton, a British technology pioneer who co-founded the Auto ID Center at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, which created a global standard system for RFID and other sensors. He is known for coining the term the Internet of Things to describe a system where the internet is connected to the physical world through ubiquitous sensors. Although it took at least another decade for the technology to catch up with the vision, adding this technology to devices and objects that are around us is quite expensive. It requires a lot of steps and tools to achieve connections between devices and software in an environment. But scientists and manufacturers believe that in the coming years, IoT would cost less. Advantages IoT can assist in the smarter control of homes and cities through mobile phones. It enhances security and 
offers personal protection. By automating activities, it saves us a lot of time. Information is easily accessible even if we are far away from our actual location and it is updated frequently in real time. Personal assistance can be provided by IoT apps which can alert you to your regular plans. It is useful for safety because it senses any potential danger and warns users. For example, GM on Star is an integrated device a system identifies a car crash or accident on the road. It immediately makes a call if an accident or crash is found. IoT minimizes human effort because IoT devices connect and communicate with one another and perform a variety of tasks without the need for human intervention. Patient care can be performed more effectively in real time without the need for a doctor's visit. It gives them the ability to make choices as well as provide evidence-based care. Asset tracking, traffic or transportation tracking, inventory control, delivery, surveillance, individual order tracking and customer management can all be made more cost-effective with the right tracking system. An IoT engineer is a multi-skilled person who manages the device connectivity and works on sensors and software updates to keep the technology upgraded for you. An IoT developer's skills include working on cloud programming, connectivity and data management, and research tools. How to become an IoT developer is a frequently searched question on the internet. To be an IoT engineer is not sufficient to get the expertise, but still you can be the best developer by following some necessary data regarding this field. Understanding of sensors. First of all, the usage and technicalities of sensors, chips, should be understood, the mechanisms of different sensors, their types, working, and all the related things should be at your fingertips to get appreciation in this field. The correct IoT developer roadmap always leads after understanding the topic's basic understanding. Consideration of wireless system. The sole system of the IoT depends upon the wireless system, thus knowledge of the wireless connectivity, network is also important for sufficient work. The job of the IoT developer includes working with different wireless connectivity systems and data science. Exposure to UI and UX. If you're looking how to become an IoT developer, here is your answer. IoT is like another running application that works by providing the correct user interface and user experience. Since the purpose of this modern technology is to facilitate the life of the people, hence any issue in UX will affect the whole system. The correct knowledge of these terms and their usage for the betterment and problem solution for the consumers is necessary. The grip on programming languages. Since the importance of programming languages is no less than any other programming system, coding and decoding are the necessity of the system. That's why it is the basic to learn the system and have some efficiency in it. JavaScript and other programming networks are important to study for the IoT developer to have the best experience. Focus on handy smart devices. Among all the smart devices, smartphones and mobile have a very sharp growth curve. Most old people keep their phones in their pockets and working become easy when people have such a device in their hand. That's why IoT engineers always work on focusing on the best way to convince their customers and the best way to convince the customers is that build the system according to their usage. Working in a new way and spreading the connectivity among people and their decisions smartly. The skill is required for an IoT developer to have a happy future in this field. Responsibilities of IoT developer. An IoT expert always works to provide the solution to networking and connectivity issues. Coding and decoding are the souls of information technology and artificial intelligence. They are responsible for manufacturing different collaborating devices, their related software and sensors. Testing the data, documenting it, and providing the solutions is also included in the IoT developer skills. Their server works on the consumer's needs 
by modifying their software according to the customer's needs. Hence, an IoT developer works with all the physical appliances and their creativity is tested when it comes to the connectivity of these devices. The development of communicating servers and solving their problems. Development of versatile IoT software to help in smooth decision making and smart life of the customer. They are also responsible for managing the backup system and developing such a system that can pass through the self-healing process easily. The IoT developer roadmap is also responsible for creating an optimized solution backup program and providing support services to all customers. You can only give a fair solution to all the client's problems when you know the importance of your roles and responsibilities in this new field. We have reached the end of this video. Thank you all for watching and hope to see you all on my next video.